Hi, I already discussed nine example of DAG. Let's discuss value number method for constructing DAG. What is value number? One number we are assigning for every node that is called as value number. I will discuss details with example. The nodes of this syntax tree or DAG are stored in an array of records and each row of array represents for one record or you can say for one node one row for one node and in each record the first field is the operation field indicating the level of node leave have one additional field which hold the lexical value either the symbol table pointer or a constant and interior node have two additional field indicating the left and right children leave have one additional field either symbol table entry or constant and interior node have two additional field one for its left side another for its right side let's see one example i will construct a dag for i equal to i plus 10 so we'll take one node for i another node for 10 and we'll add this to so plus for plus i will be its left side 10 will be its right side then i equal to i plus 10 we already have i node so we'll reuse that we'll just create a node for equal symbol and its left child will be i, right child will be plus. Now this is a DAG for i equal to i plus 10. Now let me store this DAG information in an array. This is a array that stored the node information of this DAG. First row it is for leaf i. Here id that is for identifier and its lexical value. Lexical value is i. Next row num and its lexical value is 10. Leaf have one additional field, just the lexical value or symbol double entry. So here these are the lexical value for these two leaf. Next, plus, plus is a interior node, it have two child, one is i, another is 10. So plus have two additional field, one for i. Rather than writing id or i, we are using this one. So left child is one and right child is two. So this 1, 2, 3, 4, these are the value number. We are referring one node by just its value number. In array, we refer to node by giving an integer index of the record for that node within the array. So these are the integer index 1, 2, 3, 4, these are the integer index within the same array. And this integer is called as value number for the node or the expression represented by the node. For this i node, 1 is the value number. For this 10 node, 2 is the value number. For plus, 3 is the value number. For equal, 4 is the value number. You can mark the node level plus. Here value number is 3. And in left child, we are writing 1 rather than i or id. We are writing 1 means we are referring the value number inside the array. And at right child, we are writing Two, that is the value number for 10. So inside the array we are identifying one node by just the value number. Value numbers help us to construct DAG efficiently. Just we are storing the node of the DAG into an array. One row is for one node. First column is for value number. Second column is for the level of the node. Next, there can be one or two additional field according to leaf or interior node. For leaf, there will be one additional field. For interior node, there will be two additional field. Rather than referring child name, we are referring child value number. Here for three, child are one and two. For four, child are one and three. With this, I am finishing DAC. In next lecture, I will start three address code. If this lecture is helpful for you, please like and subscribe. Thank you.